I think, you know, we're in a very interesting situation here. Uh, 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 I think that Chief Mercadier has laid out exactly the situation, and I don't think you've been overly pessimistic. You know, I think exactly, and, and it's centered on this question of power. And, and then that takes us immediately to the question, well, how do we change that, right? And you, you guys have been struggling with this long before I was born and all the rest of it. On the other hand, there is no question that changes are being made and people are struggling and working like dogs and progress is being made and, and, and obviously that has to continue. And I think that what Lloyd actually says is part of that, you know, fighting in the trenches, moving forward, a piece here, a piece there, changing this, changing that. And that's happening. Um, it's not happening nearly fast enough, but I think if one were being optimistic, and I've been all over the country in a way that very few people have, I've been lucky enough, and I would say that if I were to, if you asked me who are the really interesting new generation out there, they're essentially Aboriginal. I mean, what the French Canadians were in the 1960s, the Aboriginals are today, which is to say young, lean, really mad, want to change everything, and they're ready to do almost anything to do it. So, I mean, basically, if you said to me, I have the dictatorial rights to turn over the power to lead the country to somebody, I'd turn it over to a bunch of young Aboriginals in a minute, because I think that's where the really interesting youth are in the country. And there is a critical mass now, because the university system has started to pick up the percentages. On the other hand, it's moving really slowly. And, you know, and over the way you said it indicated that you yourself are so frustrated, you can't figure out yourself, you brilliant, I, don't know, I can't think, how do we make this go really fast? How do you get rid of the Indian Act really fast? Where's the, where's the energy to make this change? How do you make the change? I mean, uh, Joseph and, and Elder Kushen quite rightly talk about going back on the land. This is absolutely right, and it's not just right for Aboriginals.